Welcome to this video presentation explaining why we created the Praxis Framework. My aim is to show how Praxis provides two things that combinations of other guides don't, consistency and integration. Project program and portfolio management is well served with bodies of knowledge, methods and standards of various shapes and sizes from many different organizations. To keep things simple in this presentation, I'll use the term project management to cover program and portfolio management as well, and I'll use the term guide to represent all the various types of publication. To start with, here's a list of just 19 guides published by various professional bodies and standards organizations from around the world. Before we look at what they cover, I'll reduce them down to their generally accepted abbreviations. Now, if you study these guides in any detail, you'll find that their content broadly aligns with one or two of four basic areas. These are knowledge, method, competence and capability maturity. Knowledge covers the functions that make up the discipline of project management, such as the one shown here. Method describes processes that can be used to manage the phases of the life cycle and also describes typical documents. Competence covers the knowledge and performance criteria required for someone to perform the functions and processes effectively and capability maturity describes the attributes of organizations as they progress through five levels of effectiveness in project delivery. So let's see how the various guides fit together into these four areas. You shouldn't read anything into their positions on the horizontal and vertical axes. I've just placed them according to their main focus, even though some have coverage in two of the four areas. And let's say you're an organization that is serious about developing and maintaining an effective project delivery infrastructure you would need to make reference to guides from all four areas, but you would soon encounter different structures, different terminology and different principles that would need to be mapped against each other to produce a complete set of integrated guidance. But mapping is a time-consuming and imprecise exercise and will inevitably highlight gaps, overlaps and inconsistencies between your chosen guides. So what Praxis does is to reflect the best of the various guides and distill it into a single integrated framework. The result is a knowledge section that contains contextual and managerial functions that collectively make up the discipline of project management, a method section that contains process and documentation descriptions for each phase of the project program and portfolio life cycles, a competence section that describes the knowledge and performance criteria required for someone to perform the functions and processes, and a capability maturity section that describes how an organization can develop its culture and infrastructure leading to consistent project delivery. And all these sections have been written to be fully integrated and intuitively linked. One terminology, one structure and one style of presentation. But of course knowledge and method need to be supported by many different tools and techniques and behavioral models. Just a small sample is shown here. Including many of these in the main framework would make it inflexible and ponderous. And so Praxis provides a library, and in this library is an encyclopedia that describes the tools, techniques and models, all linked to the main framework. It also contains a growing knowledge base of articles, templates and sample documents. Finally, the whole thing is wrapped up into a single website that is entirely free and community driven. Community driven means that as a practitioner you can suggest improvements or extensions to any page and these will be considered for inclusion on a frequent and regular basis. No waiting for committees to update the guidance every four or five years. Praxis has the ability to continuously reflect real experience from real project managers. To see the framework, simply visit www.praxisframework.org. To contact us and contribute to the framework, you can use the Get Involved tab on the right of every Praxis page. To keep up to date with updates and news, Follow us on Twitter or join our LinkedIn group. And don't forget, the Praxis framework is community-driven and will evolve with the support and contributions of professional practitioners like you.